Hey everyone, Shaper1000 here. Today we're going to be changing this light switch. I know you guys have seen me do switches before. It's not that big of a deal. Um, I'm just going to change this out real quick. I could go turn the power off, of course, and I'll show you why I'm going to be changing this light switch, even though it works fine. Okay. Works fine. So I'm going to need to get a light set up, and I need to find out which breaker it is so I can turn this off and let's put a new switch in here. Okay, here's the new switch I'm putting in. I got this on Amazon. It was like 17 bucks. So it says I'm going to need a screwdriver and a pair of pliers. I'll be the judge of that. But anyway, let's open this up first, make sure it's all here. And we'll get on to installing our new light switch. Okay, got a couple of those. And it should be an almond, which is, yeah, so it matches the walls better. So there's the beauty plate or whatever you want to call it. And here's the switch. Okay. So, looks like I can hook it in either way. Alright, well let me check this out. It's got a protective cover on it. So that's going to look nice up there. Yeah. Okay. So, alright. Let me read up on this thing just to make sure I know what's going on and then I'm gonna pull the other one out I'll get you some kind of light set up and we'll put this one in real quick shouldn't be that big of a deal um, on off and then bright and dim so it's, it's pretty neat so it does match so yeah let me read up on this and then we'll yank the other one out real quick okay guys sorry for the uh, background noise I do have to have the air on, it's very hot. And sorry for the lighting, but I've got a light plugged in over here shining over at this, so. There we go. Now. Again, sorry, this is just a Phillips screw. There's one on top and one on bottom. This light's still good. So, or I mean this light switch, I should say, is still good. So, I'll be keeping it. And there's a Phillips here and a Phillips there. I don't know if I filmed putting this in for you guys or not, but I know I I have filmed one. In fact, the wall right behind you guys, the hallway, I might put the switch in at a later time because it's white. It's the only color we can get at the time. And I want it to match the wall. So I'll probably end up putting this switch in over there. I you know, I'll do that off camera, just backwards of what I'm doing here. That way, they'll match this. It needs to be changed. I'll keep saying I need to get one to change it, but I have not done it yet, as you can see. Okay, so, all right. Anyway. There is no power going to these wires, so I don't have to worry about anything there. Okay, okay now I'm going to go ahead and get these unhooked here in just a second. But I want to make sure I got the right 
this is ground where's it going it's going in to here okay Alright, now, one of these is low, there's the ground, there's my neutral wire, alright, okay, cool, alright, let, let me just make sure I'm going to wire this up right, okay, so, we're going, we're going to hook up we're going to hook up our ground let's go ahead and unhook this we don't need this one on here anymore alright so we're going to hook up our ground and our neutral wires You guys, I know it's hard to see, guys. I'm sorry. So there's our ground. Green's always ground. White's your neutral. Black's your power. Alright. Then our white wire, again. Neutral. Let me get a pair of pliers and straighten these out. Okay. Well, not the ones I wanted, but just gonna make these straight so the wire nuts will fit right. Just gonna straighten these out. Now our white ones are gonna go together. And then I'm gonna find out which one is also this switch came with these if you want to label them up for the next guy or the next time you do it you'll know which one's which but always know which ones are which except for the one the power your power line which is going to hook up into these so um One's your line in, which is the power, and then the other one's the load. Someone was detected at your front door. Thank you. <laughs> all right. Just want to make sure these are all so they get covered. So there's no bare wires. There we go. Okay, so the black one, you'll have two black ones as well. One is the power coming from your box, and one is going to the lights. Okay, so now I'm going to go turn that power switch on real quick, and I'm going to use my little tool here. This thing was cheap. It was like 12 bucks. But sometimes you can see where they're coming from. Like, I think, if I remember right, this one here, it's going up. I think it's going up into the lights. Because when we when we first got together, the light switch used to be over by the back door, which I thought was stupid, and I moved it over here. And I think this one coming out at the bottom, I think this one will be our power. So let me go flip the switch on, make sure nothing's touching, and I'll be right back. Okay, the switch is on. There it is. So, I was right. That is the... That's where we're going to run the, the... These two are going to hook up to here. To the switch here. So, see there's nothing here on this one. It's not... Say nothing there, but... Here we've got this thing's cool. It's also got a light in case you want to use a light, but there you go. So that's our power one. And I'll show you which one goes on here. Let me go turn the, the switch back off.
the breaker, whatever. Okay, so the line will be the one coming from the circuit breaker. It's going to go into the one that says line. And the load, of course, is the one that's going to be going to your light. Okay, just like that. Sure they're snug and this red one kind of pinkish supposed to resemble red that's the load and that's one going to the lights all right now before I try that I'm just gonna go ahead and put it in I already know that it's right so let me go ahead and get these back in here into the wall and I'm gonna get this buttoned up and we'll try it out alright it's time to check it out there it is and it's dimming and off pretty cool huh okay but that's not the cool part okay so what's cool about this that switch is it's got an app turn lights on or off you can adjust the brightness level or Alexa turn on the kitchen lights Alexa, dim the lights to 30%. Okay. Alexa, shut off kitchen lights. Okay. Alexa, turn on the kitchen lights. Okay. There's something else. I knew this did this, but I just never got around to doing it, but... Alexa, turn off the air conditioner. Okay. <laughs> Alexa, turn on the air conditioner. Okay. Alexa, set air conditioner to 72 degrees. Alexa, set air conditioner to cool. It's set to cool. <laughs> That's pretty neat. Alexa, turn kitchen lights up to 100%. Okay. <laughs> All right, That's pretty neat. So, just wanted to share that with you. Uh, monkey liked the air conditioner idea and um, I was like well you know she likes that idea I'm going to get her a light switch so uh, let's have her come out and try it okay monk so I got everything hooked up tell her to do something with the lights it looks the same pretty close yeah it's really close <laughs> um, Alexa turn light off Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Alexa, turn light on. Okay. Alexa, dim the light. Okay. Alexa, dim the light a little more. Give her a percentage. Okay. Oh, like 40, 20. Yeah. Alexa, dim light to 50%. Okay. It's already on there. Mm -hmm. Alexa, dim light 70%. Okay. There it goes. <laughs> oh, it's 100%. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Alexa, turn light back on. 
Okay. Neat. Alexa, set the kitchen light to 82%. Okay. <laughs> Alexa, set kitchen light to 100%, please. <laughs> Thank you. Cool beans. Anytime. Literally. That'd be nice. Enjoy your Thursday. There you go, Mama. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> you got you a smart home now, huh? Yeah. Now if I can get it to figure out, figure out how to get it to work on that lock, we'll be all right. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that'd be cool too. Yep. Yeah. All righty. There you go. Thank you. All right. Okay, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Shea Bear the Myth, the Man, the Legend, gone for now. Just some fun stuff. Oh, by the way, I'll put a link in the description for that thing. It was like 17 bucks. Yeah. Why so, not, then? Right? You know, I mean, it is handy. A lot of people think it's laziness, but it's not. Like, there's a lot of times I'll come over to sit down and record and forget to turn the air conditioner off. Walk back over. Yeah, she tooted. But, you know, it is handy, and but it's handy for her mom if she wants to come out right. in the middle of the night and get a snack. As soon as she opens that door, she can tell her to turn the lights on, and then, you know, so. I have to get a drink. Huh? I have to get a drink. You've got to get something else, man. I didn't do anything. We'll see you guys in the next one. More <laughs> videos to come. But, um, seriously, I'm going to do a shootout. Shootout. I'm going to do a shootout with this between this toaster, which we've had several years, it was five dollars, and <laughs> this big behemoth here that Monkey gave well, let's just say 50 bucks for 47 dollars. And it took like um, since 1927 to get here because it came on the slow boat, it took over a month to get here, <laughs> but um. Uh, so we're going to have a shootout and see if that $5 toaster is better or the $50 toaster. So stay tuned for more videos. And I got something sitting out back here. We've got a video to do on. That right there, that snapper, that's not mine. That's the customer's. That same guy that we did the, the buggy for, got the buggy running for. He's got uh, hydraulic issues, so... We got that coming up, and maybe another one tomorrow, huh, Monk? Yeah. We're not sure yet, but we're hoping, huh, Monkey? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, you want a surprise? Yeah. Okay. So, because we don't know yet. It's kind of up near, but we'll find out. But anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Appreciate it. Shea Bear, the myth, the man, the legend. We're gone for now. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye, guys. Take care, Monk. Monk, switch out. Bye, y'all. Bye, guys.